what it actually does is that it brings you uh, telephone and data communication to aircrafts of all sizes. And it brings you, for the first time, you have a speed you can live with. We're all used to uh, having internet back home, and we have also, uh, many of us lived through the ages where the speed was gradually increasing until we said, now, now we can live with it. And that's what you actually get on the aircraft. And today, where connectivity is so important for many people, uh, you want to be on the phone, you want to be on your uh, iPad, you want to be on your PC, you want to be on, I uh, almost said Facebook, and, and you want to be online everywhere at all times. And then you have to spend some hours in an aircraft uh, where you don't have any connectivity at all, and you don't have anything to do, and you're sitting uh, looking out of the window or, or sipping Bloody Marys or stuff like that, and now you can actually get internet in the sky, so you can actually continue with the connectivity you want and that you need. The special thing about business aircraft is that when people are flying them, they are there for business normally. And they, I, when I fly here in, in, the, in this aircraft and I have people with me and we are flying to a meeting, everybody is opening their laptop. Everybody is just sending and receiving emails, doing whatever they need to do. If it's an early morning flight, they don't have to check the emails back home. They say, well, we go on a plane, we go for a ride of two hours, we can check it on, on the way. So it's very busy, being, busy being used during the flight.